Hello again, welcome back. One from my beer mail from Slurpy Dave. In Beer Pubs and Jokes from the Isle of Man. I'll put the link in. And this is a beer I haven't had in many, many moons from Sunderland in the northeast of England. And this is Double Maxim. A premium brown ale. Oh yes. And I am going to have this with a whiskey. This is Eagle Rare, age 10 years, a Kentucky straight bourbon whiskey. This review will be separate. I'm going to pour it now, let it breathe for 10 minutes. Oops, that was a bit generous. So, like that. Oh my goodness. So, this one. Let's crack it open, get it into the glass. And then we can smell it, taste it, read the bottle. There we go, doesn't that look fantastic in the glass? It's crystal clear. Clear glass bottle? It's not very often you see that, is it? Let's get a wee light through that, oh my goodness. Brown indeed. That looks absolutely beautiful. Uh, half a pinky fast disappearing head. Well, it'll, it'll stay like that. It's two mil. Oh, man, that looks absolutely beautiful. Quite a malt there. You know, there's a wee bit of... I'm not going to say cabbage or gas. North Sea gas. But there's a wee bit plantiness there. Smells like dope. Dave, you've not been injecting this, have you? Anyway, let's get it down our gullets. Cheers, my dears. That is even better than I remember it. Much superior to Newcastle Brown Ale. It's got a lovely mouthfeel, medium bodied. It's nutty, malty, nutty, brown bread. Uh, there's hardly any bitterness. It's really smooth, easy drinking. Uh, that the hint of bitterness on the back end. So it's not like an English bitter, it's a brown ale. It's an absolute cracker. I could, I'd love to try this in cask. That was a delivery, sorry about that. Not beer. Mini cheddars. I've got people coming round in a couple of weeks. I'll have to buy them again, won't I? They're not going to last two weeks. No way. Right, anyway, I forgot what I was saying. I'll have to start again. So nice. Carbonation is minimal. There might even be a hint of caramel there. It's leaning into toffee malts. It's more like brown bread crust. No fruitiness in it. It's an absolute beauty. Let's have a wee look at the ball. So, full of northern character since 1901. That's just after 7 o'clock. All flavour, no flannel. Double maximum, premium brown ale, ABV 40, 4.7%. The first and only one. In 1901, Maxim Ale was first introduced to the North East. Following an increase in strength in 1938, it became known as Double Maxim. This premium quality ale is still famous among discerning drinkers for its well-rounded flavour. It's fully flavour. And they are in Sunderland. It doesn't actually say that. It's a 500ml bottle. Best before the end of June, 
2024. So it's, I think it's still fairly fresh. Despite being in the the clear glass bottle, it's an odd an odd thing. You don't really see that very often. This I could drink all day. Well, till I passed it after two. Thanks very much, Dave. Much appreciated. There is a wee bit of carbonation. Not much. Try it if you can find it. I'm going to be looking for this again, actually. See if I can stock up. I've not got any room in my beer room. It's full of boxes and my fridge is jam-packed. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time, hopefully. Ta-ta for now. Cheers, my dears.